48, 49, 50. Everybody wants to know how many pieces it takes to actually stop a bullet. We don't want to just see it go through the end. I have something set up for you guys. Check this out. This is 76 sheets of drywall. 76 sheets. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna shoot once with the 500, the Smith & Wesson Model 500, and we're gonna shoot once with the 50 BMG. Let's shoot this thing and see which one goes further. It's gonna be a fun time. Okay, I'm gonna shoot it one time with the Smith & Wesson Model 500. Then I'm gonna shoot it with the 50 BMG. Let's see what happens. Check this out. This is where it went in. It came through, through, through. Keep going, keep going. It's getting bigger, you can see. It's getting bigger. That is the last one. This is what a Smith & Wesson Model 500 bullet looks like. The Smith & Wesson has a lot of energy. It's a big bullet, it's a 350 grain bullet. And it made it through quite a few sheets. But I have a feeling, and I'm just going with my gut here, that that's a lot less than what the 50 BMG will do. We're gonna take a shot at it. Like I said earlier in my video, there's 70 sheets here, equally spaced. I have six sheets at the end to hopefully catch a bullet. I have a feeling that the 50 BMG is gonna make it most of the way through. I'm not 100% sure if it'll make it all the way through. I hope we can catch a 50 BMG bullet. That would be awesome. You guys would be stoked. I'd be stoked. So let's shoot this thing and let's find out how many sheets of drywall the 50 BMG will make it through. All right guys, I hope you can see this all right. This is where the 50 BMG just went in. Right there, okay? So, if we follow it along, we can see that it's getting bigger as it goes, okay? It's getting bigger and bigger and bigger. I mean, it's doing some serious destruction. The reason you can't see anything is because the hole is getting huge. At this point, the bullet started to turn and it went towards the other side of the drywall, but then it actually started to come back over to our side. So, we're, st we're still going and the bullet finally stopped right here. That is where the bullet stopped. This piece is good. Oh my goodness, I just saw the bullet fall out. It's still hot. This is what a 50 BMG bullet looks like after it's went through 56 sheets. Let me clean it off so you guys can see it. 56 sheets of drywall. That's insane. It actually looks exactly the same. The only thing that happened to this bullet is that the tip that's on a Hornady Amax bullet the tip either broke off or it got smashed, but the rest of the bullet is perfect. I wanted to show you guys just what each piece of drywall looked like, so we're gonna tear them apart. There's the first one, second one, third one, fourth one, fifth one. The holes are staying about the same. Sixth, seventh, Eighth, the holes are getting bigger. Ninth, tenth, eleventh, twelfth, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. You can see the five, the fifty cal bullet starting to turn. Sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, <laughs> twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. 23, 
24, 25, 26, 27. I gotta move forward. 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33. Notice that the Smith & Wesson Model 500 bullet is not there anymore. 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56. Technically, I think I may have said 56 in my video. I'm a fourth grade teacher, so I I'm still learning how to count. <laughs> I hope you guys had fun. I had a blast. I got to clean this mess up and head home. My wife's probably getting out of the gym. So thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe. If you like the video, comment. Tell me on my Facebook page. Tell me on my YouTube channel. What should I shoot next? These guns are really fun, and I need you guys' help and support to find out what I should shoot. I was just cleaning my stuff up, and I came across one of the coolest things I've ever found shooting. This is the top to the 50 BMG bullet that I just shot. It just fell off. This is awesome. If you look at this thing up close, you can see that there's the tip, and look at the bottom. So rad! I'm so excited. I found every single piece of bullet that I shot. That is so awesome. Thanks for watching, guys.